Hello guys, welcome to Zeratomas channel. Zeratomas channel. I'm Seer of Truth, and the one actually playing is still Seer of Truth, but I'm Zeratomas, and I'll be watching. Huh? It's strange being the one who plays. Yeah, crazy stuff. So what we're doing today is what we call Soulmate Thresh, which is Dark Harvest Thresh. Uh, the reason we're going for this is because, um, well, as we've shown in previous videos, uh, Dark Harvest on support is just terrifying. And then the Dark Harvest damage on top of the Flay damage is, well, even more horrifying. It was doing way more damage than it ever should have been. And then, also, the reason that uh, Seer of Truth here is playing is because he's far better at Thresh than uh, I am. So, if I po do poorly, just think about how bad it would be if Zeratometh was playing. Now, for your <laughs> other runes, we like to go Cheap Shot because it deals damage after uh, impair impaired movement goes <coughs> off, so you use your ability... And then you hit them and you get the bonus damage, which is super handy. I go zombie ward, because I like to clear wards. Pfft, having, let's see. having extra wards around helps. You could go ghost poro or eyeball collection. It's really just kind of how you like to play. Um, then I go ingenious hunter, because I have a... As support, I find I always end up with a lot of uh, active items. So having those with less CDR... Especially seeing as my last Soulmate Thresh game where we were figuring out how it does, I ended up with uh, Righteous Glory. So I just go f booking it down lane at people with a soul, just yeah. like chunking their ADCs. You could get the heal on abilities. <laughs> that wouldn't be particularly useful considering your abilities aren't exactly doing a lot of damage, they you're not really exactly are. healing a lot. And it's then Relentless Hunter wouldn't be bad because, well, you're Thresh and Thresh roams. Yeah. So that so plus Moby. These two would be your best. Now, for your secondary options, you could really pick a lot of things here. Uh, I like to go Inspiration, because Biscuits and Boots are awesome. One of my favorite boots combos. And biscuits, boots and Biscuits. You could go Resolve. Here I'd probably go like Iron Skin or Conditioning, and then uh, you could go Demolish. 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 Wow. Demolish. You could go Demolish. We're just going to Demolish some things now. Or uh, Second Wind are very good. Uh, but though, you know, pick at your own uh, or like what, font, font of, of life. life if you really want to be extra supporty. Uh, precision, if you're just all about this damage, go some uh, Coupe de Gras. So when you get that, that soul in, your, in you and you get the flay and you hit them when they have no, like 40% health or less, is that it? Yeah. Yeah. You just kill them instantly. Just instantly get them. And then I <sighs> personally would go lifesteal on this one, though tenacity is also useful. Uh, this one's not useful because you're not attacking a lot. You want one basic attack to chunk them. That's it. You're like an assassin. Unless you're just trying to go super souls because your souls increase damage of every auto. But, anywho. Uh, or you could go triumph because it's really strong. You're going in. I'm still going to go inspiration. So this is what we're going. Uh, so yeah, we'll just see y'all in game. <laughs> Hello guys, welcome to in game where we play... Thresh. Soulmatey Thresh. Now, when you're doing Soulmate Thresh, it's probably best not to... Go Relic Shield. That's what he was gonna say. That is what I was gonna say. You're gonna let me get there sometimes. Well, uh, you know, you're pausing too long, so I figure I'll just jump in. Relic Shield Thresh uses your Flay passive on minions. Dark Harvest Thresh, you want to use your Flay passive on laners. Because you're poking them, and you're poking them lots. <coughs> and Dark Harvest goes on auto attacks, add Dark Harvest to flay, and everyone dies. Yep. And that's pretty much our plan today, to make everyone dies. We played a lot of it the other day, um, and it does pretty well. You know, hopefully uh, your team does well, though. <laughs> that's uh, that's a mean, thing we learned. It's, it's, a pretty, it's a pretty greedy rune. So it makes it harder to do a lot when uh, when peeps be behind, but it's all right. Yeah, true. That it is a very greedy rune. But at the same point, to be honest, what else are you gonna go? You aftershock maybe. Guardian. Guardian, you could. Yeah. Um, it's probably a variety of things. Airy, comet. Everything. Uh, spell book, glacial augment. One thing we learned in all of our testing of how this works is that uh, Scion drops two souls. Once when he dies the first time, and then once when he dies again. Yeah, it's pretty uh, ridiculous. After his passive dies, he drops the second soul. Which really makes us wonder if, uh, if you're playing Dark Harvest Scion, right, can you pick up your own soul? 
because you can still pick up stuff like red buff and whatnot while you're in your passive. Uh, but could you pick up the Dark Harvest Soul? Yeah, makes me kind of want to see like Dark Harvest Scion, but yeah, maybe maybe we'll do that in the future. At least for we'll definitely try it out maybe in like a custom or something. Cause I mean probably oh, the biggest issue with that. that. I shouldn't have tanked that. Probably the biggest issue with trying to do the Dark Harvest sign is the fact that Dark Harvest wouldn't really work out very well. Okay, for we're guy. level two. Hook, hook, hook! Oh, uh, why did you not hook? Well, he ran backwards anyways. It would have missed, no matter I what I know. tried there. And uh -huh. I couldn't get to them. Uh, maybe I could have. Either way, so now we just wait for these cannon minions to die, and then we we auto attack. Souls, give him, give me. Hold on to your flay while you wait for the cannon minions to die. You could, like, if you really knew how long it was going to take the cannon minions to die, I guess you could use it. But I uh, mean, in truth, you're putting out the damage anyway, so technically you're doing the same amount of damage regardless. However, we want to whack people hard with one hit. Come on, use it, use it. One second, one second. Or the other cannon dies. Uh, oh, there we go. And now we got no more oh. souls. Now whack someone else. Oh, you act a shield. It's okay, I've got uh, sustain. Holy electrocute. Holy electrocute, though. Alright. <clears throat> I'm okay, though. Well, we chunked them pretty hard. Uh, uh, mostly. They chunked you harder. <laughs> they chunked me pretty hard, too. <clears throat> That's the problem. You gotta be a little careful if they engage on you when you're trying to get a poke off. So, I guess don't be too greedy for the pokes. That's my problem. Me and I get it. I'm like, hit them in the face! Show them who's yeah, boss. You have 20 seconds to wait. That was not well timed. Uh. Oh. Yeah, I gotta get out. Yeah. You're a tad <laughs> low. They're gonna go on me. Boop. Yeah. And you're dead. Nope. No, I'm oh, not. Oh! Virus flat. They both flashed. Oh my gosh, ping their flashes. And ping and ping. That's hilarious. Varus so thought you were going to die if you live with 20 health. I know better than to think of- Whoa! And you got smoke. <laughs> I was- I didn't, Well, I guess it wasn't really What is he going to do? do? If he yeah. runs that way, Udyr gets him. And if he doesn't run anywhere, Udyr gets him. <laughs> Poor guy. That was definitely just unfortunate. J4 was bot side. Why didn't he help? He was like, okay, I would uh, actually probably just grab a control word, but up to you. Mm. But now I don't have enough for a pot. Aww. So? You don't need no pot. <clears throat> Four and one Udyr. Holy hell. Does he have uh, He got electrocute. That's interesting. That really sucked. Udyr just happened to be in the right spot at the right time. <clears throat> yeah. There was nothing I could do. He smote me. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I would say you could have exhausted him, but it still would have killed you. It though. still would have Reduces hurt, damage yeah. by, like, what? 90%? But you only had 20 health. <clears throat> now at least we'll see if he's coming this direction. Yeah. Ugh. That was an unfortunate death on my part. Oh, well. Happens. <clears throat> Oh, you're just getting fed in this game, holy. Now another thing you could do is just try to go for uh At least we have a Teemo. Teemo's pretty anti Udir, but anyway. You go for just a full out engage when um you've got a soul proc. Just be like, Yep, yeah, I'm good. Thanks for the more souls. Thanks for the more souls. Yes. Remember kids. He English is. English is my 14,000th language. It's not, uh, it's not necessary. <laughs> it is necessary. Our audience speaks English. Yeah, probably. Some of them. What, like, all two of them? <laughs> all two of them, yeah. Oh, oh dear. Good hook, good hook. Play, yeah. Okay, you can't exhaust. Okay. Alright, but uh oh. Damn. Did so well there too. Mm. 
Uh, I would probably stay to soak up some experience. Mm -hmm. Ah, but you're a turret dive. Yeah, don't. Dude, you're running around for the turret dive. Yeah, I'm out. Just run away, yeah. Sucks, because there's souls coming in, too. Well, whatever. So, Udyr's probably taking J4's blue. Yep. Because, well, he can. This is an unfortunate game. That Udyr is doing very well. Yeah. So, probably get resistances. Right Got a couple more pots for the sustain. He didn't take my control ward, so... We can still come back from this. Just like I tried to do there. Keep peeling for your ADC. Don't be afraid to pop in the damage. Uh, with him dying right next to me, it means I picked up his soul. Yes, allies do drop souls. Yes, you can pick Which them up. Which is pretty ballin', but... <clears throat> this is why I like to take it in ARAM, because everybody's dying all the time. I end up with souls really fast. And there's almost always a cannon minion on map. I think the way it works is uh, the cannon minion will... Uh, uh, each team gets a cannon minion, one, one per round. So like, blue gets their cannon minion, and then in the next wave, red gets their cannon minion. It's kind of interesting. It was, I noticed that when I was playing Dark Harvest in uh, ARAM. I don't think that's right. It is. That or it's every other wave, one person gets a cannon minion. So. Anyway. Oh, my little zombie ward. So cute. We gotta be careful, unfortunately, because, well, one, they're six and we're not. Oh, we both warded. That's good. That means it'll take them twice as long to clear out the wards. Yeah, probably, that's what it is. Probably not something you should have done, considering it has, like, a friggin' 20 second cooldown. Well, Udyr's dead, so you don't have to worry about him ganking. <sighs> that's nice. Um. They are still level 6, and I am still not. Good job. Good job. Blocked, like, pretty much all the damage that was being thrown at the guy. That was the plan. <laughs> if, if the friggin' Thresh Lantern Shield is enough to block all that damage, then there just wasn't any damage. <laughs> there really wasn't that much. Like, that shield is, like, 100, so whatever. A hundred damage that he would have just outright taken before. Tucking? Tucking. You mean you mean taken? No. Received. No, I definitely didn't want to say that pretentious <laughs> word. Uh whatever, mate. Um So we got mids missing. I don't even know who the enemy mid laner is, but they're missing. Katarina. Cat, yeah. Oh, we're pretty far back. They're not gonna be able to Oh, do oh much. dear. Nice. Uh, wow. Wukong's a poppin'. Hi. Off. And you just got souls. That's dead. More souls. Pick up the soul. Pick up the soul. Oh, I didn't think I didn't pick up the soul. You didn't think I didn't. Yeah. That's actually proper grammar. No, it ain't. If it sounds stupid, it ain't proper. It's stupid. Have some soul. Have some. Have some protection. Soul protection. You blocked a whole one dragon shot. It's actually really good. So yeah, this uh, this shield is based off of souls. I wish it was also based off of uh, dark harvest souls. It would make my day. That'd be pretty awesome. <clears throat> That's an interaction that they should have. Just all of flay, or all things that are based off of souls. Based off of dark harvest souls too. Based, based off of dark harvest souls. No, you didn't pick up the soul from the dragon. Now you tell me? Well, I just noticed now because of your, uh... You know what? You're the worst. You could have said something like an hour before, but no. <laughs> Whatever, man. Grab a control... Oh, never mind. Don't bother. That control ward is going to be handy. Nah. <coughs> Keeping us knowing we're safe from back here is nice. Yeah, I like having uh, back control wards like that. Normally I don't bother because normally their jungler doesn't run that direction. 
Yeah, but I mean, when you're behind, there's the possibility of turret diving. It's always good to have a ward in. Six and one push. Wukong. That's a thing I like to see. I want that soul though. Well, you could have went ham for it. That's nah, not worth it. It really is though, because it's like permanent four damage. But go for it! Go for it! Go for it! Oh my lord! You could have went for it. They weren't there. At least grab that one. Frig. I, I was pretty sure it was just gone. So. I didn't see it anymore. They last for a long time. They do last for a long time. Oh. Nice. Good timing for Rakan to engage. Nice, you got your souls. And look nice. at that, I whipped him so hard. Nice. There we go. Coming back in this one. Too bad no one on your team uh, died. I don't know why Wukong's complaining about you not lantern lanterning him in. I mean, it's not exactly necessary because it's Wukong, but whatever. That's okay. what I thought. <clears throat> like, okay, so as somebody who plays a lot of Thresh, I've learned when to lantern and when not to lantern. And I'm going to tell you, lanterning in a Wukong was not worth the lantern. Lantern instantly makes them back off instead of going in harder, which is part of the reason that we got both of them in that. Um, I understand what Wukong's saying, if I landed him in, he would have been on top of them a lot faster, but maybe Varus could have gotten away, uh, where I went straight on into Varus, and I, and he, he was way over here, I was over here, my lantern doesn't reach that far. I would have to move backwards to get the lantern off. So, uh. though I appreciate where Wukong's coming from, I have to disagree with him there. Good old civil discussion with only one side of the story. Those are the best. I tried to get Wukong's side. He would have gotten in a little faster, but I mean, he could I mean, have just invisible in anyways. Well, yeah, it's why I think he wouldn't need to, because Wukong has a pretty decent way of just getting in. Grab that coin, grab that coin, grab the coin, grab the coin. Why can't. Oh, well, we're pretty far distance. Now, <laughs> I don't know. It, <coughs> oh, oh, that is a turret diving deer. Wow. Zero map awareness causes everyone to die. Oh. Because, yeah, first of all, that control ward. Second of all, the turret. Third of all, though, that was fast. That was a friggin' fast as all hell of a deer. I died very quick there. Let's go for some realms. And I'd probably grab another cloth vest. Because Udir yeah, plus sure. ADC. At least they focus <laughs> me, not my Jin. Yeah, that's always nice because. Nice. Um, it's too bad you're not there. That's two deaths that you could have grabbed. Aw, oh, man. I wasn't going to risk my life for that. You should have. Should be risking life and limb for the ADC to get kills. Well, not a terrible game anyway. Like the Timo just got a kill. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. I mean, on one hand, nope. On 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 one hand, kind of cool that Timo can kill the friggin' Akali if he does it right. On the other hand, if he gets kills, then that means he's worth something again, which means the college is going to keep popping off. But anyway, oh well. So, when trying to hook a cat, it is always best to throw the hook at wherever their knife blade is, or at yeah. towards but behind one of their minions, because that is where they will dash. In this case, she is gone. Yeah, it looks like she dashed right onto friggin' J4. Okay, so you just got a soul, so you got 20 seconds to whack someone. Akali's right there. Would not go for the Akali. I'm going for the Akali. Ah! Oh, that didn't work. 
I don't know why I hit flash. Uh, I'm stupid. Did the Kali not die there? No. I thought Wukong would, would have easily killed her. I mean, it's a Kali. A Kali's got hella hard to sustain. See, that was a 5e4. I told you not to go for a Kali. I thought we would burst her down. You were right there, but I definitely <laughs> thought we were going to burst her down. I've seen Wukong pretty much burst down uh, anybody, so I was under the assumption that would work. And it's not like she's particularly tanky or anything. Yeah, but... Getting her out of the fight, seeing if she's 9-2, and two, would have been nice, and it looked like a, a good pick. One thing to keep in mind, though, is the fact that it's Akali, and Akali's got a lot of sustain. So, there we go. Mountain Drake alive instantly dies. <laughs> I'm also, this team has kind of got a bit of a negative attitude. It's all like, I can't lose LP, therefore why should I try? It's like, because you have four other people that probably can. Why can't they lose LP? Oh, they just ranked up. So they have no LP to lose? Yeah, but they can get demoted right away. But that is a thing that can happen, guys. Oh. Well, there you go. Go grab that soul. You didn't grab the soul. I'm over here. Uh, there you go. Oh. Let's see what we can do here. Also, it affects your MMR, whether you're losing LP or not. It's going to be affecting your MMR, which is best to not affect. He ran out of position. Oh, I guess he was fine. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Now, when you get to this kind of point, you've got a decent amount of stacks on your souls. You could chunk people down if a soul drops. But you also have to keep in mind that your job is to keep Jin alive. <laughs> Jin hurts. Keep him alive. Get this soul. With or without souls, Jin's going to be doing far more damage than you. Keep him alive. Also, if you go too aggressive for souls, you could easily die for them. Which obviously you don't want to do. Just a bunch of zombie wards in there. That was one hell of a warded bush. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Got Kali's coming down. Oh, time to run. You we are the out honey there. fruit. Wow. Hey, I didn't realize you could do that from the minimap. Me neither. Oh, yeah, because they got the green dots. So yeah, you can. That's weird. Actually, I didn't realize they did show up. Doesn't make them any less weird. Yeah. Okay. Uh, oh, that's an Akali that is a little bit out of position, but now isn't. Oh. That was horrible. That sucks. Not quite sure why you hooked to the Rakan, like where he was at that moment. It was pretty clear he was gonna go jump to a Kali, and also in my head, a Kali would be better. Um, he wasn't quite close enough, and he was gonna have to keep walking forward. Ah. So if I grabbed him, maybe he wouldn't be able to save a Kali. Why can't I just? Why can't my lantern pick up that soul? Come on! Up. There you Aha! Go. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Auto attack someone. Holy crap! Free Nine. soul. No, why Just you stayed for so long? Oh yeah. man! Here, have have. Oh, it didn't. It didn't actually right. work. Grab the soul. Grab the soul. Rakan died. Don't tell me what to do. I do what I want. Grab the soul. Okay. Well, we're two thirds of the way to max souls. That's something. We're also not at the point where more people okay, are going to be dying, which means they're going to be getting more souls. Oh, yep. Uh, uh, hook him. Oh. Uh, Hi guys, you get just, out of there! You're like screw using abilities. I did use. I'm abilities. only gonna use half my abilities. I, mean, I would have tried hooking the deer. I got stunned. From what? The deer? Okay, when I said I would have tried hooking the deer, I meant while he was running at my team. Well, before he could have stunned you. I knew he was gonna turn around. He might not have. He was fast, man. 
It would still be better just to he would, keep him from even getting near your team. I mean, if I what I would have done is hooked him afterwards, pulling myself away from a collie. If he went farther, yeah, then I would have hooked, hooked him because that would give me mobility. Um, but personally, I feel like what I did was the smarter choice. Just <laughs> wall them so that my team can keep going. The enemies can't get can't I get. I probably want to use my ulti, but mm. you my only ulti. really needed flay, mm. which you didn't even use. I did not. No, I shielded and ulted. Yeah. I was going to fly next, but it didn't go out. Yeah, you died too fast, but... I you, died pretty... I don't think you really quick. needed to use your ulti. Probably uh, my ulti enough. has a fairly short cooldown. It'll probably be up it's by the time minutes. I need it. Two it'll, minutes ain't that short. That's summoner spell long. What okay, I'm saying quite, is it, it, it'll probably... It's not two minutes. Well, yeah, it's a little over two minutes. Well, either way, it'll be up by the time I need it again. It always is. I'm never. Don't be afraid to use your ult as thresh. It's not even that really high impact. It's just really good for peeling. It's high impact. Don't listen to this guy. It's crazy good. Always be afraid to use it. Soul, soul. Do you know what? Soul, Screw soul, using soul, it ever. Souls. Never use it. <laughs> it's too good. Just don't use it. Nice. Hook Rakan, hook Rakan, hook Rakan. No, I said hook Rakan. I tried. Well, you like failed. tickled his tail feathers. <clears throat> tickled his butt. I'm not gonna flash for a con. You <clears throat> should have. She's like, I'm gonna stand close and get the souls instantly. See, told you it'll be up again. Oh, shields! Oh, should be hooking people. I did! Nice, nice. Uh, oh, oh no. Yeah, Flay. She's gonna dash to you and then. Oh, good. <laughs> she could have possibly dashed to you and then Jin if she can get snared first. Now hook someone into turret. Look, your blitz crank. I don't have much uh, health right now, so I gotta be careful. Be careful of those. And sometimes people put wards in this area. Um, so. That's not a. Uh, mm -hmm. No. Caught her out. Damn son. That's dead. That sucks. Thanks for the soul though. I tried to give him vision of what that was going no on. No damage. There. Jeepers. Oh, 128. That's not bad. So far, so good. Done 567 damage with it. I gotta go back. Gotta get my health. And Which is like way more damage than the sport would ever do. Should we fly Kindle? Go, go, go. And all I've been wor focusing on is peeling. This isn't like my Duskblade Thresh support that I did where I was just. I was but that was versus the Scion who was dropping so many gosh darn uh, souls. It was ridiculous. Souls everywhere. Never seen so many. Souls and he was in my life. like, he was feeding too. Like he died a lot, and then also uh, he drops two souls per death. So that scales us up quick. Yes, it does. I ended up with eight, th almost eight thousand damage in that one. Should uh probably have upgraded your R four. Yeah, R4. you're right. It's fine. Look, it does a little there. It's enough to show you one bush. Yeah, no, it totally needs an upgrade. But it's just so cute, and I have so many fond memories of it. I can't just... just Abandon it. That would be heartless. Or soulless, as they would say. What's the uh, what's the damage on your base damage? As we can tell, damage? I have a lot of souls. What's your base damage on your Dark Harvest? On Dark Harvest. 64, that's pretty good. Yeah. Holy crap. Oh. Okay, so... Oh, let's go this way. Oh, I no. thought she was going to keep going. She did not. Um, can't grab that soul. God damn it, Lantern. Pick up souls. That's literally your only <laughs> job. <laughs> well, souls and people. Kind of surprised you can get a soul off of the virus who died, though. I guess we weren't quite close enough. Hit her. Wow, uh, alright, you missed everything. Holy. Apparently I am very bad. This 
why we get souls, well, though. Let's holy see. crap. What uh, am I doing? Soul, up there. Okay, there we go. Okay, we hit the 150 mark. Woo! Why am I bad? <laughs> Everybody, please unsubscribe and delight dislike this uh delike oh my god do you like this please uh, just kill me don't even just, bother with any of that just kill me now just skip right to the friggin finale there and murder him well there we go so we're at 160 souls not bad no also at the 1k damage mark dark harvest will give you an extra about 220 damage wait until i start or one whack. shotting people this is gonna be great yeah, at about 50 minutes in the game. In about 50 minutes in the game, you'll see that uh, they won't have assassins left. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Assassin will jump in and then die. Now, what do I want next? Normally... Frozen heart. Why? To reduce Judeer's attack speed and Varus's attack speed. You know, just a thought. Yeah, sure, whatever. Initially, I said it, just kidding, but then I came up with a legitimate reason to grab that. <laughs> yeah, it's legitimate enough. We'll end it with a dust blade. <laughs> yeah. Frozen heart into dust blade. Give this to my gym. This isn't the best with the gym, to be honest. No, but you could give it to Timu. Yeah, Timu needs it very bad. Yeah, or J4. Though, honestly, Wukong. I'll make use of it. But so why'd you give it to Jin? Because I still haven't upgraded this damn thing. Oh. I'm feeling like that gives vision. Like, who's the enemy support? Rakan, right? Rakan, yeah. He's Aerie? Freaking weirdo. Who would grab Aerie on anyone, ever? I mean, Rakan it's not horrible with, but I feel like uh, going pretty much anything else. A lot of people like to go, um, you're not, you're not getting close to this guy. Sorry, bud. You're not, you're not getting close. I refuse to let you get close. Thanks. Just, uh, Oh, snap. You're whacking people hard. Holy balls. Give me that soul. Okay, you got your soul. Whack someone. Uh, it would exhaust a collie. Uh, it's too late now. Grab that soul. Grab that soul before you die. Worth it. You waited so long to exhaust her. I thought it was too late. <laughs> Jesus. It was too late because she got too far away when I said too late. Oh. <clears throat> well, you really shouldn't. Kali's pretty tanky. I was a yeah. Mostly bigger. she just uh, heals a lot. I hit she has else pretty decent health. Much harder than I hit her. But yeah, I guess maybe it's that uh, healing bit. This is working out fairly well. I've already surpassed the 1k. Like, when we last checked, holy we were crap. at 900. In that yeah. fight alone, I did a lot more damage with yeah, it. Another 900. Like, holy crap. And that was just in that last fight. Picking up souls and dealing damage. I'm almost at 200 here. This is going to start going up really quick. Uh, now that I passed the uh, 150 mark. As long as I can actually get souls. Yeah. Too bad I, did, I let Jin die there, but... I mean, you really shouldn't have freaking dashed onto Rakan there because of Akali. Because of Alkali. And your team's dying. And you're not even there to pick up their souls. <clears throat> yeah, when your team dies and it gives you souls to help push the fight forward, it's awesome. Yup. I got you. I got you. Yeah. I don't actually need to hit anybody, I just need to show them I'm here. You know what? Uh, I'm gonna put a, put a nice little ward there. God damn it, Jin, don't tell us to back off. You're not our real mom. Arr! The hell was that? That was me enjoying myself. I'll never do it again. Can't tell me what to do in the privacy of my own home. It's not your own home, it's my own home. Uh, uh, no! God damn it! Just flare. Or, I, I actually just meant auto attacker, but dead recon. You grabbed his soul. 
I think you auto grab it if you kill him. Shields! Jesus Christ. Oh. Yep. Dead dear more soul. 200 souls. Damn, son. 220 soul mark. Doing well with those souls. 2k damage. Oh. Oh, God. I hit her pretty hard there. Yup. And not not dead yet. Oh, there we go. There we go. Damn, son. And I'd probably pick up some health. You have zero health. And it's killing you. <laughs> okay. Health. Um... Frozen mallet. You know you wanna. No, I really don't. Actually. Frozen mallet, frozen mallet, frozen mallet. Okay. Um. Grab. I don't know, maybe some magic resist with that health. So, like, an abyssal mask wouldn't be terrible. This, because they have a lot of consistent damage. Consistent AP damage. That's true. Magic, not AP. Magic damage. No, they have consistent AP damage. But yeah, so yeah, the adaptive no helm damage. should reduce the damage dealt by uh, Varus from his. I think it's his W. I mean, he does magic damage every hit, every auto attack. So should help with that. Grab a soul. Now I can smack somebody. Really effing hard. I still haven't upgraded my red trinket. Yeah, you're kind of stupid. You know who else is stupid? You. You never tell me when it's important. I mean, so. It's not because I'm stupid, it's because I'm, I'm okay. trolling you. Grab that friggin' control ward, holy crap. What control ward? Well, that one really? Right there. That they weren't earlier. Well, all I knew is where uh, Rakan was, and he was pretty close by, so... Whatever, man. Look, Teemo's doing it. Yeah, Teemo's ballsy. Whatever, man. Teemo's also 713. I don't think I want to follow Teemo's lead on this stuff. Why? You're one in six. You, you have a worse hmm. KDA. Minus the A anyway. Just ignore that part of the KDA. <laughs> hey, uh, I guess whack him. Oh, you did no damage to him. Alright. No! Whack, that you whack someone. There we go. Holy crap. They're dying so fast. I'm not even sure if the damage is mine or my team's. Here, just have a shield. I'm helping. He didn't no. want to use it. He didn't. He didn't want to use it. Fine, whatever. I didn't like More you souls. either. Two hundred fifty souls. Yeah, let's do this. Come I've already come. done, and it works on inhibitors. Over three thousand damage. Who <sighs> dears uh, bad? Some he shields. can carry. I'll have they're both tanking a different freaking turret. Yep. It's been hilarious. Let's do this! Shields, everybody! Everybody have a shield! GG! GG. Oh, so that was Dark Harvest Thresh uh, in his not quite prime. Kind of somewhere in the middle. I'll give you guys a, a ro rundown of my best game stats, how I did. It was yeah. freaking fantastic. This is still one of the most fun I've ever had in League of Legends, just outright. Uh, Thresh hits like a truck with Dark Harvest. Project. More project, more project. Yeah. Finish the cop. Um. Black screen of death? I guess? Hello? <laughs> okay, there we go. Hello. Alrighty. Let's look at the advanced details. <laughs> they ever want to work? Which they don't. Uh, graph. My damage done wasn't great, but it was about three thousand times or three thousand damage is better than it could have been. Yeah, true that. And you know, I was one six twenty one, but yeah. it was still I still did pretty well, I would say. Oh well, that was that game. Uh, Hope you enjoyed. Yeah. See y'all in the next one. Bye bye. Peace. Take a look at this. This is the game that uh, I probably did the best. So, hey, here's their uh, 7,992 damage with Dark Harvest.
And then 998 damage, cheap shot. If this told you the amount of souls I had, I had upwards of 500 souls by the end of it. 13, 7, 24. I was starting to one-shot their ADCs. This was fantastic. This yeah. is what we're, our goal was. And that's also why he got Dust Plague, so he could hit hard, too. Yeah. So, yeah. There you go. Just watched a video that I myself had made with no help from Seer of Truth whatsoever. If you wish to see more of my content, on the right you'll find our most recent video. And if you wish to see something other than my most recent video, then go to the left and you'll see something else. Good times. Also, like and subscribe as this year just whispered into my ear all so strange-like. Bye bye